Carly, this is Amelia and Alec, and we are Team Aces here today to present on Milestone Films. Um, so just, uh, or well, we had uh, the pleasure of interviewing Amy Heller, and just a quick background. Um, she and her husband, Dennis, started Milestone in 1990 in a one-bedroom apartment in New York City. Um, um, Amy graduated from Yale with an American History degree and didn't have any prior business um, background. And uh, still today, 22 years after um, the business started, uh, it's still just the two of them running it. Um, so that's uh, Amy Heller and her husband, Dennis. Um, they're just a film distribution company um, with uh, the way films work is when you want to show a film at a theater, especially more like second run and uh, not theatrical, you have to get the distribution rights and stuff. So what they do is they just um, they handle that. They also restore 35 uh, millimeter prints as well. I think their oldest uh, restored film is from 1896. So um, here are a list of some like really prestigious awards in the film industry and just some um, notable ones. Uh, the Archival Award for their work with the film I Am Cuba. And then in 2008, they were awarded the first ever um, um, Legacy of Cinema Award for, quote, their tireless efforts on behalf of film restoration and preservation. And then she also shared with us a bunch of big names that she's worked with, that her and her husband's worked with. And some that stuck with us were um, names like Martin Scorsese and Woody Allen and Dustin Hoffman. So that was really cool to hear about. So how did they get their start? As Carly said, they started the company in 1990. Her and her husband, Amy Heller, and Dennis Doros is her husband's name. And they just started their one bedroom Manhattan apartment. It's very small. And for the 22 years they've been going, it's just been the two of them. They've never hired anybody else to help them with anything. And um, Amy had a lot of exposure um, throughout her life to film and independent films. And it was really their passion for the independent film industry that led them to want to do restoration and distribution. And then um, what were some of the big issues they faced? Um, a lot of them had experience with independent films, but none of them really, they didn't really know how to start their own business. They just kind of went right into it. And since they, they loved it so much, they just kind of did it. And um, this is a quote from Amy that she told us. Like, we both love film and knew a lot about it, but neither of us were sure if we'd be able to run a company. We're still not sure how we do it since, I mean, it's just the two of them. And then, what were some of the things that they would do differently? Um, another quote from Amy is, I think Dennis and I are pretty happy with our decisions back then because they got us to where we are now. But I know Dennis said, has said that he wished he had asked his bosses more questions about running a business. So they kind of wished that before, they started doing this, they kind of did their research and asked the questions they needed to in order to have the knowledge of running a business. Um, so we asked them where do they see milestone films in the future, and I also asked them uh, like if they think the decline of 35 millimeter is going to hurt their business. Um, a lot of companies are shying away from using 35 millimeter and just sticking to digital. Um, and since their business focuses specifically with 35 millimeter film, I asked them if they think that's going to Effect and like the quote says, she said it's hard to say. Some people have said we should stop and let us um, say our business will start booming. Um, she says it can go either way because either um, people, or either they'll be doing more 35 millimeter restorations because everyone has stopped paying attention, or um, they, no one's going to care that they're doing 35 millimeter restorations. And then um, we asked them where we were, uh, where I asked where she saw herself in the uh, future. And she loves her job. Um, she even has, like, they blog, her and her husband go back and forth on, on their website and blog. And she has this whole post of why she loves her job. And um, as the quote says, like, she loves, like, all the steps of distribution and exhibition of films. Um, and uh, they're pretty happy with it. And they think they're going to continue with it. And with them continuing with it, like, just the two of them for uh, so long, they're probably going to stick with that. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you.